Yo, Venomous White here. Um, before the video starts, I'd just like to say, so between episode two and three, and two and three have been an absolute mess. The, the recordings got jumbled. I lost a bunch of um, apparently a bunch of the recordings didn't save. So there's been a there's been a couple of mix-ups as well as some other issues when it comes to the uh, the editing, but. I managed to piece some of it together. After this episode, it clears up a lot, though, um, and hopefully it starts to improve. As a we're pretty new to um sort of playthrough, so hopefully you'll see as the season goes on, I'm able to you know hold talk a bit longer and explain what's going on a bit more. So it's a, it's all a learning process, but I um, hope you enjoy. I'm really enjoy enjoying doing it. So um, I've been Venomous White. I hope you enjoy the video. Uh, have a good one. Cheers. Hey, welcome back to part three of the Outer Worlds. Last time we won the fight down here, got ourselves an assault rifle, and we're gonna go kill these pigeon things oh, right off the bat. So she dies real quick. But we're gonna wanna go kill, I wanna kill these pigeons. <gasps> Same, don't prov. Oh, Pravati. Defensive means shoot, yeah? Okay, we need to sort that out. You have a gun. Wow. Let's do a bit of looking around here for these pigeons' nests, they bring things back to them. I'm gonna kill this wolf. Okay. Not even a scratch. You're not fighting, Pravati. Do I have to put you back on aggressive? What's... What's defensive do? Once told to attack, it continues to fight aggressive. Okay, we, we're we going to need you on aggressive then. Because I need you to back me up here. Let's so loot this. Loot this. Loot this. Assistant. That says the stuff. I've recorded this beginning part a couple of times because I forgot to save between two and three because I got to run all the way back to the ship. And I've died a couple of times. But we're going to go get. We're going to go get this domicile. What's this? Alright. You hold there. Sure thing. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. We'll talk later. Pravati, can I give you... What if I go character? Guns. Get rid of that light machine gun. What if I give that to you? Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna climb up here real quick. No, 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 no. You're not holding. You're not holding, Pravati. You're not holding. Sure. Hold around the back here. I'm going. I don't want you in this fight. I don't want you to die. One. Take me, cover, 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 provide a cover. Oh, thought that was me dead. All right, there's still a sniper, provide. Still a sniper. Let's just loot these guys real quick. Another assault rifle. I'm pretty sure there's a sniper around here. Hmm. 
No? Oh, did you tap him, Pravati? Very nice. Okay, let's just take all this. Quick loot up. I think that was a new helmet there. Ooh, nine armor. Oh, that looks cooler. Pravati. Give you that one. Put this away. What's this? Some messages? No, no thank you. Armor parts. This says that everything's in a cave. So we're going to go to that cave now. Go to that cave. Get that book. Get back to town. Save. I'm going to loot this up a bit more. I feel like there's something important up there. I don't know. <sighs> more heavy ammo. Okay. So hopefully we can just get to this. Another assault rifle. I think we'll keep her with the, the light machine gun. Let's just loot all these guys. What's that? Is that a bad guy? These fights are nerve-wracking, just knowing that any loss can set me back, or set us back. Alright. We've got to level up. I'm not going to bother doing that right now. We're going to put that on. No, not on her. Not on Pravati. God, no, not on Pravati. Pravati, you can have that. We're going to wear that one. Oh, I don't like... What's that? What's that? That sounds like robots. Run. Run, Pravati. Run. Let's just get this book. Bad guy's right there. Don't see us, don't see us, don't see us. Sneak. I need to make sure I reload my guns as well. That's been a problem. I've got a pistol here. This pistol seems better than the other one. Okay. Model spaceship service award. Criminal activities, that's fine. We've got the journal. Return to Vicar. We might just return straight to town. And then we'll go investigate these fellas at the, what's it called? Uh, the deserters, we'll go find the deserters. Let's see what their plan is.
my stupid footsteps. Let's get into town. Let's go visit. Let's go visit the vicar. All right, Vika, please give us something good. We discussed? Got your book right here. This is fantastic. Well worth all the sacrifices I... Wait. What the fuck is this? Is this French? I can't fucking read French. It's a law-forsaken joke is what it is. French. Ha! I was so high and mighty, preaching to the yokels about following the plan while fighting it at every turn. Uh, what? Well, uh, yes. But I assure you, it was not for personal gain, only for the great... Okay, so he wanted the book for himself. ...searching for the keys to unlocking the secrets of the universal equation that underlies the plan. I had hoped this book held some of those answers. I became so desperate, I even got myself assigned to this plague-ridden backwater to find the damn thing. All the time and suffering I've spent. Wasted. Okay, well, um... Well, at least you've got a meaningful purpose. As if my life should have no greater meaning than proselytizing to a bunch of feeble-minded wretches. Ooh. Nothing could be more excruciating than discussing the true nature of reality with people who have no interest beyond their next Aetherwave program. But that's neither here nor there. What I need to do now is to find a translator, obviously. But to do that, I'll first need to secure transport. You have a ship. Perhaps I could make myself of use to your crew. No. Uh... Yeah, I wouldn't mind a ship hat. I already gave you most of my money, but I can offer you free spiritual counseling, and I'd be happy to watch your back. I'm pretty handy with a toss ball stick, or any blunt instrument, really. I'm also a passable gun hand if it comes to that. I can usually talk my way out of conflict, though. Oh, I'm fairly competent at hacking computers as well. Sounds good, let's go. Let me get my things in order, and I'll catch up with you. Edgewater's gonna miss you. Folk here always had good things to say about their vicar. Thank you, Ms. Holcomb. I'll be glad for the change of scenery, and to leave this place behind. I shall see you on the ship, Captain, whenever you're ready to leave Emerald Vale. Okay, so we got a... ship hand. I'll meet you on the ship when you're ready... Okie dokie. Let's do this, um... Let's do this. I think guns. Put five into guns. Four into that. Leadership. And one into... That, I suppose. We'll apply. Then we'll go perks. Better vendor prices. We'll grab that one. Now, does Pravati level up? She's level four. She does a lot of melee damage, but her health's low. Okay. Okay. I 
I'm gonna pause it here, go back to the ship and save, and then we'll pick up heading to the botanical gardens, I reckon. Okay, uh, back making our way to the botanical gardens, and we've run into a little bit of a fight. What have we got? One, two. I reckon we can tap these guys. No. Tap him. Yes, Pravati. Get the sword out. Get the sword out. Alright. I was hoping to make it more than 10 meters away from the ship. The ship's just there before we got into a fight. But. Oh, we got more up ahead as well. One, two, three, four. No problem. I'll head over. Don't yell. Pravati, hold here, hold here, Pravati. Don't push. Where's this guy run off to? Ah, oh, die! Alright, we used way more ammo than I ex really intended to there. But we won! And we got nothing out of these guys. Wow. Some bit cartridges. An apple, I guess that's fruit. I guess that's water, which is good. Or an orange juice or something. Can't complain about that. What's this? Energy cells? Don't think we need. No, we're not going to pick lock. 20 more heavy ammo. Light ammo. Light ammo. Is that about it? Was it? Probably should have just run around that. Be right there. Alright, so what's our carry capacity at? 71 out of 90. We're going to need to drop some stuff off and sell some stuff soon. I don't want to fight them. And we're hungry and we're thirsty. Well, let's take care of that if we can. Got an apple. Let's, um. Let's eat an apple. Let's eat another apple. Let's drink some apple juice. There we go. Not thirsty, not hungry. Things are on the up and up. It's looking good. Uh, let's go up here. Oh, more. Let's run through this way. We'll get to the botanical, botanical labs. Things are everywhere. What's up here? Oh, you can see the whole world from here. Oh, hello. Two health. Nice. This just run straight across here. Bad guys to the left. Let's just run straight across. Straight into the botanical labs. We're done. I 
feel like we need to go to the community center for something. We'll do a little bit of a crouch here. Have a look at the journal. Um, uh, no, the geothermal plant has been taken over by robots. Ah, and all the medicine is in that community center. Okay. Dead bodies. Nice. Nice, we'll take whatever that is. Take that, we'll take that, we'll take that. We'll take three heavy ammo for sure. Take that, oh yep. The tuna stuff that people keep talking about. The only thing these guys seem to make. Tire their sauce. Another heal. We got 17 heals. 20 energy cells, nice. Don't have an energy gun. Don't know what that is, don't know what that is. Another heal. What's that? I'll take whatever that is as well. Bypass shunt, I think they're for computers. Light ammo. Oh, that looks like water. All right. Community center is just here. Move along, stranger. We don't want any trouble. Hello. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. <sighs> looking for Adelaide. Adelaide. Geothermal plant. Geo what? Look, plants ain't my purview. You're better off asking after Adelaide. Okay. If you're gonna start wandering around my camp. About farmers. Where can I find Over Adelaide? Tending crop. Enough with the question. Um, yeah, I gotta repair well, my ship. You, buzzing around the aether with your very own ship. Rest of us gotta make do with the ground at our feet. No, I'm sorry. That was unworthy of you. Lady named Zoe went missing some nights ago. Just up and vanished without a trace. Okay. We'll keep an eye out for like Zoe. Zoe. Can't imagine. Uh, let's smell this. Don't worry, we'll find her. We'll find Zoe. These guys have got to have a shop here, don't they? What's this? Is this a shop? Choice. You a shop guy? We got canid something I can. What are you selling, buddy? And that includes canid meat. Two thousand four hundred for this gun. Seven hundred. I just want to sell some stuff. Like that. And 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 that. that. Oh, we got 2,000 bits. Oh! I'll sell that as well. We'll sell the hibernation suit. We'll sell that. I don't know what these things are. Sure grip. We'll just leave that for now. Let's go talk to Adelaide. If you're hungry, there's meat turning on the spit outside. If you bear an illness, find a place to lay your head down and I'll fetch you a poultice. Whatever your troubles with Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? Um, you must be Adelaide. I've been called back, among other things. Green thumb, 
grandmother, the strange old lady who keeps flowers. But yes, Adelaide will do just fine. Excuse me, Miss McDevitt? Sorry, it's just... You got such pretty trees in here. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. Thomas speaks of you often. Staying long. Okay. You should try some of my tobacco tea. I brew it in an old spittoon, but it's been cleaned. Um, Reed sent me to make peace with you. You here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace then? Um, you're living off power belongs to town. Come actually the cannery, that's about it. Yep. Like everything else that comes out of Edgewater, that peace offering is canned. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. Ask me to uh, divert the power to him. He mentioned the geothermal plant, which is full of robots. The question is, why would you agree to his plans? <sighs> Your camp has a power regulator. I need to repair my ship. You want ship parts? You ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. If you're going down to the plant, you should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. Think about it. We'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service to that odious cannery. Seems the sort of thing a hero would do. Hmm. You hear it to you, maybe. To the people who matter. To us. To the ones who come around. To the ones you save. Reed will never understand. He has been too long inebriated on the wine of corporate culture. All he sees is productivity, output, profits. Let's say I help you. What happens to Edgewater? Life in Edgewater grinds to a halt. The cannery shuts down. Workers desert in droves, and our own little camp grows and thrives. You think Reed's trying to spy you? Have power to Reed's town, and you'll be killing us. Reed knows it. He's counting on it. Uh, what have you got against the town? A miserable excuse for a town with your own lamps. Hollowed out workers laboring their lives away at the cannery, living off whatever scrap spacer's choice throws them. You know that's true, don't you, Ms. Holcomb? Your father died of overwork. His heart gave out. He, he was tired all the time, sure, but he was old, ma'am, and he raised me all by his lonesome. Look what they did to this child. Lost her family to the company, and still she defends them. Hmm. I think you've made your point clear enough. I'll see what I can do. <sighs> Great, so we have to choose between this lovely old lady in her trees and that horrible guy. Wow, okay. Oh, hey, Thomas. Oh, I uh, didn't see you there. I was, uh, well, I was just occupying myself with a little engineering. Whoa, Miss Parvati. Hey, Parvati. Uh, what, um, how, how are you? Hi, hi, hi. Uh, hello. Are you, uh, uh, are things safe out here? How are you keeping? Great, just great. I've been trying to keep stuff running, just like you. Only I'm not so, wait. They didn't kick you out, did they? Oh, gosh, no. I, I'm just along with this fella here. Are you from town? Uh, I mean, you don't exactly look like you're from town. Never heard it phrased in such a way before. I guess we're all trying to get our ships off the ground, ain't we? Mm, God, Sorry, he's an idiot. I just wasn't sure if you were from town or if you were one of us. Something's been chewing at me, you see. Oh, okay. The fact is, I've been... Well, lying to everybody here. Camp thinks I'm a mechanical genius, but I couldn't fix a busted chair. 
Never too late to start learning. I could give you a couple pointers. Boom. I'll take all the help I can get. I set my mind to learning the craft of the engineer. You see, I want to make something of myself. You ever heard of the Young Spacer's Guide to Mechanical Engineering? Comes in a set of three. If I had my hands on one of those data pads, I could teach myself the ins and outs. Those are good. My dad kept a copy with him when he was working in the cannery. I know the old community center kept a copy. Should find another one back in town. If you could find me even one of those pads, I'd be greatly obliged. I'll let you Would know you if I find anything. I'd be grateful. Alright, let's go. Okie dokie. So, journal. The long tomorrow. Receive the cachet of medicine. Search Zoe's home for clues. Let's do that real quick. Now, I got up to this part before, and this is where I died. Zoe here. Which one is it? This one. Wants to run off and be a bandit queen. Which is awesome. Apart from the fact that she's in the center of a bandit town. Surrounded by heavily armored bandits. Oh, what's that? Light ammo, energy ammo. We'll take it. So I reckon... That guy only has a sword, doesn't he? Oh no, there's three. Five exo helmet. You know, let's pick this. You're fat. Bit of ammo. We just used way too much ammo on that fight. What kind of helmet do you have? Oh, you got a 9 helmet as well. Wow. Dexterity is below average. Guns. We should push this fight. I wonder if we can get them all grouped up. One, two, two dogs, three, and I know there's like four more back there. Two there.
fuck, there's you, Pravati. I'm so sorry. I thought you were a bad guy. Oh, we won. We won, Pravati. We won. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, Zoe's alive. Hey, Zoe. Wow. You crossed them all off, like some sort of heroic accountant running down a list. Teach me your ways. Um, you, Zoe, your people are looking for what? you. You mean Adelaide's little congregation of nature-loving nobodies? I could not possibly be less interested in them. You, on the other hand, you were a sight to behold. If I had half your skills, I'd be the greatest outlaw the coast has ever seen. Uh, I've been sent to find Why? you. Adelaide wants me back on garden duty or something? Thanks, but I'm not going anywhere. This is where I belong. I can't imagine how food's awful, comedy's worst. And no serial dramas. And no serial dramas. I've been thinking about going back. I just gotta know if Lord Cavendish really is the masked marketeer. I'll take my stuff and head on back, I suppose. Grace is gonna be glaring knives at me, so I've got that to look forward to. Need you to clarify oh, something for clarifying. me. Are you a prisoner here? Uh, no. I insinuated myself into their company, see? And they didn't seem to mind one whit. Oh, okay, cool. Your companion has leveled up and gained a new perk. Go to the companion page in the ledger. Okay, cool. Let's loot. What's this big red? Whoa, what was that? Was that a robot? Rush him, rush him while he's down. That's the last of <sighs> Solid. Do a quick loot. We rescued Zoe. Okay, well. Nothing of importance here. We're gonna need to buy a. Oh, uh, no, thank you. Gonna need to buy a bit more ammo, I reckon, as well. We really don't have that much. Oh, 33 bullets. Okay, we'll take that. Don't know what it is, but why not? Take some more light ammo, energy cell, we'll just take it all. We'll pick this, might be something good in it. Riot armor. Ooh. What's that? Six. Okay, so it's worthless. All right, let's head back to Grace. Oh no, we nearly just died to a mine. That would have been dreadful.
That would have been absolutely dreadful. Killed all these guys before. What are you going to give us? What is it? Wow, you're rude. Talk Zoe into coming back. We always get along, but I'm glad to know she's safe. What happened anyway? She joined up with a band of marauders. They hadn't heard her. Zoe joined up with a band of marauders. Zoe. The same Zoe who doesn't know a barrel from a trigger. Well, I've heard stranger things. You pretty much did my job for me. Least I could do is pay you for your trouble. Let me know if I can do something for you. Oh, okay, let's go check out. I his... don't know what you did to talk some sense into Zoe, but I appreciate it. Okay, so she can't do anything for us, and one of our weapons is broken. That's broken. We have to repair that. Plus 4,000 XP. What else have we got to do? We've got to kill some robots. That's going to be difficult. We've got to find three volumes of the engineer. And we've got to receive the cache of medicine. Alright. Okay. Deserter's reputation increased. Um, I think we'll call it a day there. Being venomous, white. Thanks for watching. Next episode, I think we're gonna we're gonna tackle the long tomorrow. We're gonna clear out the community center, get that done, and then we'll be heading off to pick a side. I don't know what side we're gonna pick, but I've been venomous, white. Thank you.